Dozens gathered in front of the Wilson County Courthouse tonight for a vigil for a 20-year-old mother. Isabel Palacios is presumed dead after she disappeared in late July. WNCN's David Hurst joins us in the studio with more. David? Yeah, Maggie, family and friends lit candles and prayed for some answers tonight. All they know right now is that a man has been charged with their murder and they won't find closure until she is found. She was like another daughter to me, and I know how much her little girl misses her. To those who know Isabel Palacios, the past month has seemed like an eternity. The disappearance of the 20-year-old known as Chevelli has left a void in many people's lives. It's a void most notably felt by her three-year-old daughter. When she sees her picture, she says, that's a picture of my mommy. And are you looking for my mommy? Family, friends, and police have been looking for Palacios ever since she was last seen at the home of Gregory Parks on July 31st. Parks is a convicted felon, and he was later charged with kidnapping and killing Palacios. Police say Palacios' body has not yet been found, but they have enough evidence to connect him to the murder. Well, this leaves family and friends searching, searching for answers, for closure, and for their beloved Chevelli. If she is gone with no life somewhere, we just want to find her. So we can at least have a, a funeral for her, to bury her. So we can at least in the future tell her daughter where her mother's at. Police are not saying what evidence they have that ties Gregory Parks to the murder and Parks claims that he is innocent. Maggie.